The idea is to develop a dynamic splint like handoff process for finger rehabilitation. Over 15 million people are affected by stroke annually. More than 50% of stroke patients show residual terraces, especially affecting the arms and hands. Those with residual voluntary movement can benefit of self rehabilitation throughout hand dynamic system. Today, self rehabilitation is performed by using elastic bands and springs, which exert a passive resistance to voluntary movement. The drawback is the impossibility to control mechanical stiffness during exercise. Our goal is to use the electric elastomer actuators in order to control mechanical stiffness. Benefits of this approach include real time control and customization of exercise. For this purpose, the electric elastomer actuators have advantages which include compact size, low weight, and versatility of design. The actuator consists of multi-layer stack of polypower electrode film. As a proof, in our experimental setup, the user pulled the tandem wire connected to the multi-layer actuator, which was connected to a load cell to measure the force in real time. Advantages of downfield polymer film consist of maximization of unidirectional actuation and no need for high free strength. These are dimensions and properties of the actuator. Bench test in uniaxial elongation allows us to assess the force elongation curve up to 2.5 kW. This video shows that when the voltage is off, the actuator follows the wide curve in force elongation plane. When constant voltage is on, the actuator follows the red curve. Since the stiffness doesn't change much between the off and on, we implemented the stiffness with lab view. As a result, we were able to control the stiffness. In this example, the actuator follows the blue curve, which corresponds to a higher stiffness. We were able to demonstrate performance according to requirements. As a future development, the force could straightforwardly be increased by stacking more wires. The concept we have developed shows potential for compact size, low weight, portability, shock tolerance, low power consumption, and acoustically silence.